Hey there, it's Imran and you're watching Imran Plus. Welcome back. Today we're going to be checking out the official second trailer for Fantastic Beasts The Crimes of Grindelwald. Um, this is going to be released this year, this summer, and so far we've only had one trailer which you can check out my reaction to right up here. But now we're going to look at the second trailer which I hope is going to give us a little bit more about the story and what exactly is going on in this movie and this franchise. If you saw my last reaction then you know that even though I am a fan of Harry Potter and the world of Harry Potter, I'm not really sure how I feel about these Fantastic Beasts movies just because I'm not really sure what we're building towards. So hopefully this movie is good and you know establishes something but I still am confused as to why we have Newt Scamander in the middle of a storyline between Dumbledore and Grindelwald. So I mean, I guess we're gonna have to see. Before we check out the trailer though, if you haven't already, make sure you click that subscribe button so you don't miss any upcoming videos. The Batman releases this week and I will definitely be making videos about it. So you wanna make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Check out my new header and logo to get a sense of how excited I am for that movie. But for now, let's check out this trailer. Memory is everything. Nice. Without it, we are blind. I like all this stuff. Like, we need the fate of our world to chance. Connecting back to the original movies. I like that we're at Hogwarts. Thomas, but I've just received troubling news. Tell me, what is it? It's Grindelwald. So I miss Johnny Depp. My brothers and sisters. Oh, what is Ezra Miller? Begins today. Ooh. As long as we know it is coming on them. If we're to defeat him, you'll have to trust me. Mr. Kowalski, we need you. I said I want an out and I want out. Ah! You do know I'm a witch, right? Dumbledore asked that I give you something, Jacob. Okay. <laughs> this is the team that's gonna take down the most dangerous wizard in a century. It's crazy that we have a bunch of new characters in this movie. <laughs> Who are some of these people? I don't know. What are you doing? Is that looks cool. With or without you, I'll burn down their world. Dangerous times favor dangerous men. If by tea time all of us are still alive, you should consider our efforts a success, Mr. Kowalski. My pleasure. I'm liking the magic that we're seeing in this, so that's good. We really intend to turn you back Who is Ezra Miller playing? What is going on with this character? You said we could Whoa! The world. Even if we make mistakes. Ooh. We can try to make things right. That's cool. That's a nice throwback to uh, Gala of Fire, right? Or the fight in the mid. Wow, that was cool. We're gonna need some help. <gasps> There's nothing you can do to stop the me. legendary battle. Whoa! Things are not quite what they appear. I trust you're enjoying your wand, Mr. Kowalski. <gasps> Can I keep this? <laughs> Whoa, a muggle using magic? You know what, speaking of magic, I actually really, really like the magic in this trailer. I think that this is probably one of my favorite of the three Fantastic Beast movies in terms of the magic that we're seeing. I really like that. I mean, this is the world of Harry Potter. It's a wizarding world. I want to see magic, and I think that the magic in the books like it was really cool, but I don't know if I ever truly loved how they depicted it in the movies. Um, I feel like it lost a little bit of what makes it special because the spells all kind of look the same and they're not yelling them. So we don't know always what they're casting. So I think a lot of some of the magic was taken out of the magic, but I'm glad to see it being returned here. I like the visuals and I, I, I think it look, that part looks really good. So I'm excited. I like that we're at Hogwarts a lot, like this is really feeling like a 
Harry Potter Wizarding World movie. But I know that that's not where most of the movie takes place. They're just showing us the good parts in the trailer. So we'll see as to how good the entire movie is. But I feel like from this trailer that there's going to be some really cool moments. And so I'm excited to see that. What did you think of this trailer? Are you excited for this film and will you be watching it in theaters? Or are you still on the fence about this franchise and the direction that it's headed in? Personally, I'm not really sure if I'll see it in theaters immediately, but I think I will eventually see it just out of curiosity. And I really want to see the magic and the moments that they're hinting towards. So we'll see. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had a great time. Lots more videos coming soon and all the Batman coverage this week. So make sure you like this video and subscribe. Click the bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming videos. And don't forget to share this video with your friends and fellow movie enthusiasts. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.